When you start looking at, at Lake Amistad, it is, it's this pristine body of water in so many ways. It's, it's generally going to be very clear. You've got visibility at times where you can see 20 plus feet deep. Um, as we've said before, the lake goes up and down. There's not a lot of development on the sides of the lake. I mean, the only boat docks you're going to see are, you know, at the few marinas where you unload at. Uh, there's not, you know, houses that go right down to the body of water. I mean, those things just don't exist. So when you're running down the lake, you're seeing this desert landscape of rocks and uh, southwest Texas, uh, Mexico type landscape with big bluffs in certain places, cactus and weasatch and salt cedar and mesquites. I mean, it's just, it is, it's just kind of this rugged, remote destination that gets bass fishermen excited. There's one. Good one. Uh, Better one. Yeah. Ta -da. When it comes to fishing Lake Amstead, uh, there's a lot of things to keep into mind, um, depending on when you're coming. The water is going to be on the rise or on the fall more often than not. And you can look at, uh, you know, you can type in Lake Amstead water level and you're going to get some great data that will pull up. You can look at it and see the current conditions. Uh, setting up your, your electronics, I use the Garmin's and I use the water level features all the time to be able to, once I look at that level, I find out how the water level is setting up. I'll type in, um, you know, 30 feet low, 40 feet low, 60 feet low, whatever it may be. And then I color code everything from there so that I can identify where I'm running, what's going to be in the water at that given time. Use your mapping to really be able to look for contour lines and, and cover and, and everything. And honestly, I really like to fish the lake in that 30, 40 feet low scenario because there's lots of uh, lots of drains, lots of canyons, lots of places you can go up in to, to get out of the way. The lake really fishes really big then and there's a lot of different ways to catch them then. Wow. <laughs> Golly. Stay hooked up. I can tell you're pretty. Golly. I like that one. Man. Skinny water. I'm telling you. <laughs> That's fun right there. He crushed it. I like it. Go back and grow up. I mean, that was shallow, shallow. <laughs>